YouTube, fuck what's going on? Y'all see me drinking my fucking tea and shit. Uh, Alright, so let's jump straight into it. So this video is going to be a lot different. It's not going to be like all the other videos I did. Only because I got a new job and this new job is like, I work with like six other techs and um, mechanics. And they make a lot of noise, like air tools going off every second, people yelling, like, if I'm mad focused on a car, someone will come over and interrupt me for something stupid, most likely, or try to have a conversation with me. So just a lot of action, there's a lot going on in the shop, whereas though I can't sit with you throughout the whole video and tell you in details, you know, what to do. So this video, um, is probably just have music in the background playing most likely, but there will be no talking me. No talking at all. It'll be just uh, in the beginning. Like, well, in a minute or two, I'll tell you exactly what I'm going to be doing. But video is going to be fast forward. Fast forward most of the the whole vid. Actually, the whole video is going to be fast forward. This video is going to be on um, 2013, actually. In the vlog, I said 2012. But it's a 2013 Dodge Charger 3.6. And, and that vid, I'm going to be... Going to be replacing the uh, radiator. So, like I said, there will be no talking, no audio at all. Just You'll just see me fast forward the whole fucking video and shit. So, uh, the job is not hard at all. Uh, it pays book time like a little bit over two hours. Uh, actually, you can get that shit done less than two hours, I believe. This type of video, being as though it's not really instructional, was just all visual. My suggestion, uh, for those who are not experienced, if you don't know how to remove a radiator or bleed a cooling system out properly, then I don't think you should like watch this video. I have another video with uh, 2000 Mitsubishi Eclipse when I replaced the radiator and I also explained how to bleed the cooling system with a vacuum bleeder. Um, I don't do... I don't ever, almost ever, bleed cooling systems manually because uh, it's just old school. And uh, my bleeder, it, not only do I bleed, but I refill the cooling system up at the same time. So I just like I kill two birds and one stone. And especially that type of tool works out better if like you don't like whatever your line of work is as far as mechanic go, but you know, I'm flat rate, so I ain't got time to uh, manually bleed shit. So the vacuum bleeder does, it's like the MVP of that fucking job and shit. So, um, like I said, if you have a problem with experiences, video ain't for you, you can check out my other video or you can check out other YouTubers. They got shitload of fucking videos on how to replace a radiator or manually bleed the cooling system properly videos on those. Maybe I should do a video in the future on how to bleed the cooling system manually, but that's up in the air, but I ain't looking that far in the future just yet. So, um, that's all I wanted to talk about. And, um, yeah, I guess I'm done talking. I ain't gonna run my mouth. So, um, make sure you got your coolant. Uh, Make sure you got an oil catch can or something to catch fluid at the bottom of it because you will get antifreeze everywhere. Um, the coolant is orange. Do not mix it with green shit. You could mix it with universal coolant if you want, but if you ain't know about it, take your ass to Dodge or Chrysler and get their uh, Mopar 5050 coolant, the orange shit or whatever. Get that shit. Ain't nothing wrong with putting it back in there. Um, thermostat, it'd be a good time to place the thermostat i normally suggest replacing a thermostat when doing like water pumps and like radiators and shit i don't always do it together but this one uh, i'm not it's just doing a radiator so it's one two three process so this whole job is easy it's not hard at all even taking a fucking bumper cover off it's not hard at all you just gotta pay attention so when you see me doing everything what you what you see is what you get that's the whole fucking job so um I said, I'm done talking. Jump straight into it. I'm saying. Beats by Paul.
Oh. Mm-hmm. 